notification game. Check in. Polar game. Check in. Hey, man, I want to say congratulations to the homie Polar Bird, man. Bird, man, the one on Dallas. Man, it's so entertaining. I got to watch it. And if I go to sleep and I wake up and you drop the video, you know I'm on it, bro. On me. Shouts out to Polar Bird, man. Y'all know it's Polar Gang up in this mother... I thought you knew, man. But anyway, we're gonna sign out like this. It's Polar. So much ice. I should have brought my fur. After the club, I might leave with her. Go tell your jury, man, to step it up. Cause then the stones ain't bright Welcome back to the war in Memphis. Ever since the CIAA shooting, young Dolph's career skyrocketed. Every media platform wanted to speak with Dolph. Everyone wanted to know what was going on in Memphis. With young Dolph being as boisterous as he was, he had no issue explaining to him. He felt Yo Gotti was trying to take advantage of him. He felt signing with Yo Gotti would give him all the credit for the work that he put in on his own. So if you really open up the books on this... It's kind of a double-edged sword. You can really understand where Young Dolph is coming from with this one. Public opinion is on Young Dolph's side so much, it forces Yo Gotti to come out of hiding and speak on it. Backfield. Me and home never had one argument. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Ever in life. Mm -hmm. We never touched each other. Ever in life. We never uh, exchanged no money ever in life. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The facts is just, I'm the biggest rapper from Memphis. You know what I mean? I help a lot of rappers from Memphis. I don't know, you know what I mean? Like, I, I can't really think of. Mm -hmm. If I ain't want nobody to win from Memphis, why you think I keep blowing niggas up from Memphis? Mm -hmm. Back to back. We making anybody that's, that can become rich and become successful in Memphis, we doing it. Probably. Yeah. You, you want to sign them at one point, right? I mean, I I, uh, I actually was helping them at one point. Mm -hmm. I really just just want to sign them. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Giving them advice, letting them come out on my shows. You know what I'm saying? Like telling them how the game, letting my people work with them. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like to advise them on how to build this company up and all that. So it was cool. Okay. Right. Cause I just want to get past this. I, I, I think you and Dolph is two cool individuals, and that. When you start seeing people get shot at repeatedly and shot, it's like, all right, it's going too far. Have you ever felt like you guys should have a one-on-one -on -one conversation? I don't feel nothing really. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it's hard to feel something you don't feel is real. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like even 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 um, at one point I even was asking myself like, yo, where this shit can come from? And I, I looked at me and Holmes to text all the time. So I looked at the phone out there. My phone out there. I let you read the last text I ever sent home. I think we should do that. Give, give my phone for me. Last text I ever sent home, I'm going to let you read it. Mm -hmm. and, and you know what I mean? Like from there, it's like, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't writing songs. I ain't tweeting. I ain't, I ain't doing none of that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I think, you know, somebody else got to answer that question or like, you know what I'm saying? So I think, you know, somebody they got to answer that question. Though, like. he, he was trying to get a verse or something from me. Mm -hmm. You know, you, I don't know if I, you know, probably didn't do that. I never done the verse, but I don't know. Maybe I didn't do the verse in time. I don't know. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. Which ones you want me to read? It's, it's Start right now. What's the date? Though? Yeah, what's the date? August 24th, 2012. Last text, that's five years ago that's how you gotta approach this shit homie just gotta stay down and make the right decisions and you can win big my nigga you in a good space in memphis but you gotta take that shit from there to the world and it's gonna turn into money stop being a fuck nigga for i pull up on you that sounds very positive to me that sounds very positive to me don't let people assume shit not in this era man it's the internet man real a real it, it, a real Nigga versus the internet. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like this, the world we living in. Like people you're not gonna win. Yeah, people will you think what whatever saying? they want to think. Sometimes it's not even worth it. You're not gonna win. To like you argue. never finna see me on Twitter ranting, trying to clear some up mm -hmm. or explain some. Oh no, they want me. Who do this? They want me because this. Not happened. gonna win. Like to you argue. never finna see me on Twitter ranting, trying to 
clear some up mm-hmm. or explain some. Oh no, they want me. Who do this? They want me because this happened. Or oh, I ain't say that. He said, or oh, you never gonna see it. Right. Like quit asking for it. Whatever you hear somebody saying something about me, don't expect to see me respond. No, like it's not gonna happen. Mm. I'm not going to Twitter to talk back to him. I'm not going to Instagram. It's not gonna happen. Like real nigga versus the internet. You're not gonna win because no matter what you say, you know what I mean? You can tell it flat out. You know what I mean? Like, word for word, break it down, and they still not, they wouldn't get it. No, that's the truth, because somebody gonna be under the comments right now saying, he's lying. He got it all set up. <laughs> this is not true. Like, right. like, like, I'm not gonna get it. Like, I never, like, man, like, I, I, I want home to be safe, successful, everything you want to be. Like, I, I, I want home to be safe, successful, everything you want to be. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, you know what I mean? Like, we from Memphis. Like, at the end of the day, the more artists that win from Memphis, the more next artists going to win from Memphis. Mm-hmm. If I ain't want nobody to win from Memphis, why you think I keep blowing niggas up from Memphis? Mm-hmm. Back to back. We making anybody that's, that can become rich and become successful in Memphis, we doing it. Yo, Gotti lets it be known how important he is to Memphis. He helps a lot of people put food in their homes, money in their pocket, and giving guys opportunities they wouldn't have if it wasn't for him. He's never going to come out and say he was hating on Young Dolph. In fact, he implies it's quite the contrary. His career is where it needs to be and dudes is hating on him. He makes it extremely clear he will never be on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, anything dissing anybody. He ain't typing out no paragraphs. He's only about action. As time is gone, you can tell he hasn't told not one lie. We'll get back to Yo Gotti. Let's go ahead and bounce down to Memphis, check in with Dolph. He's got some hot shit he wants to get off. What's up with you and Black Youngster? He don't know me, I don't know him. He never met me. Oh, so about him pulling up in the hood and all that type of stuff? Hey, you ever heard of a publicity stunt? Yeah. In Memphis, it's the thing called people tricking people out the streets. Mm-hmm. That's what we call that right there. You know what I'm saying? Get people unfocused on what they're doing. That's all it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, Dolph you know, built himself up and built himself into becoming a superstar, and all that us throw Dolph off right quick. He doing too much. Dolph you know, built himself up and built himself into becoming a superstar, and all that us throw Dolph off right quick. He doing too much. This thing right with you and Gotti and like Youngster right and all of you guys being from there. And man, since so many people look up to y'all. I'm like, well, damn, is the beef ever going to just like, not you say you don't have beef, but is it ever going to be in tune where y'all can just work together? I know it's a lot of hating going on. It's just a lot of hating going on? I know it's a whole lot of money count going on. A whole lot of hatred going on. A whole lot of envy going on. Mm-hmm. A whole lot of jealousy going on. But when does that stop, though? Because it's like, doesn't it, shouldn't it ever be like, you know what I'm saying? Because for real, I'm going to be real with you. You know, you, you seem like a cool dude. Gotti, I know Gotti, and he's super cool with me. And I know Youngster, I know all of you guys, all of y'all <coughs> seem like you're straight dudes. In Memphis, it's the thing called people tricking people out the streets. Mm-hmm. That's what we call that right there. You know what I'm saying? Get people unfocused on what they're doing. That's all it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, Dolph. You know, built itself up and built itself into becoming a superstar and all let us throw Dolph off right quick. He doing too much. Come on now, man. The city can't say, they mention Memphis, they say, Dolph, we can't, we don't know. He doing too much. Don't get mad at me when I'm doing my thing and it's like straight authentic. It's just straight all real. It's just straight all 100. But and it's people the- knowing it and people really it, like people realizing it and it like you can't, don't knock the next man for getting his money, period. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just like that. That's that how I look at everything, point blank, period. Any man that hate on the next man from getting his money or being successful, doing anything, whatever, you a bitch. That's just point blank, period. I can't respect nobody for that, especially a older n- hating on a young n- that's from the same section, same city, same anything. And you, you hate, you no, know, you was a bitch. Uh uh-uh, uh, no. Uh-uh. Why do you always throw Gotti's brother in it, though? I'm so confused. Because they family. I know these people. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, why do you always throw Gotti's brother in it, though? I'm so confused. Because they family. I know these people. 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, they want to do everything and they can to not let the truth and not let the blanket stay on there. But come on, man, it's, it is what it is. What's, what is, you know, what, what's the secret? I support anybody to hustle, anybody the way they get their money. I love that. I love anybody to get up and do something to hustle, make their money, take care of their family. That's what I support. That's what I like. That's what I encourage. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm about. But, man, you can't hate on the next person. That's okay. female sh That's bitch sh Well, I Come mean, it is bitch to hate on someone. I don't want to be involved in this whole weird <laughs> stuff. What's up with you and Black Youngster? He don't know me, I don't know him. He never met me. Oh, so about him pulling up in the hood and all that type of stuff? Hey, you ever heard of a publicity stunt? Yeah. Have you ever heard of a, uh, a, uh, come on, it's see-through. Like the windshield, like you get in your car, you can see straight through your windshield. Yeah. The whole situation, see-through. I don't I can know. Send, I can make somebody go to any neighborhood I want to. You think some people you just don't play with, some people you just don't try. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to be smart enough to know those people that you don't play with. You know, money bag, yo. That's your guy, the artist. Yeah, but wasn't he like your boy too? I knew him before, I knew him, I had a relationship with him, I knew him before he signed with him. You know so, what I'm saying? Like they reached out to me to, to get on a song, do a video. I can't wait to do it. They're like, oh, what we need to give you, what's this? Y'all ain't gotta give me nothing. I don't need no money, I don't want no money. Oh, so you and him are so good. We good, I ain't got no, everybody know what's, what's what. Young Dolph in the whole city of Memphis knows in order for you to sign with Yo Gotti, you need to be going at Dolph. That's part of the contractual agreement. So black youngsters' antics can only be the work of Yo Gotti. These two guys have never met. Same thing with Moneybag Yo. He can't have ties with Dolph anymore. Those things have to be separate. Over the next six months, Young Dolph will keep this run up. Continuously speaking on CMG, the CIAA shooting, and promoting his album that's basically a play-by-play -play of the crime scene. Unfortunately, the two camps run into each other in Hollywood, where Young Dolph gets shot at again. At Harvey, breaking news, a shooting at a popular tourist spot in Hollywood. Tonight, a rapper is in critical condition. It happened just after one this afternoon in front of the Lowe's Hotel at the Hollywood and Highland Complex. And CBS 2's Dave Lopez is live in Hollywood with more information. Dave. Right in front of where that shooting took place, we can't tell you the rapper's real name is Adolph Thornton. He comes out of Memphis. He's been a big star on the rap scene since 2014. He goes by the name of Young Dolph is his rapper name. He is in critical condition, according to the LAPD, but not life-threatening injuries. He apparently is either still in surgery or about to get out of surgery after being shot numerous times in the upper body right across the street and they say it could be back to it could go connected to a feud that rapper rap groups are having the feud that goes all the way back to february Everybody screaming gang. this is 32 year old rapper young Dolph, whose latest album is entitled bulletproof and one of the songs on that album a hundred shots and detectives say just before one o'clock this afternoon he was shot Detectives say three men approached him right in front of Lowell's Hollywood Hotel today where all four were guests. There was a fight, Young Doll fell to the ground, and that's when one of the three suspects opened fire. No idea what the altercation was about, what the verbal fight was about. Not at this point. It just sounds like it escalated from a back and forth sort of argument. Seven months ago in North Carolina, after a concert, Young Dolph had his SUV shot up. Police say nearly a hundred bullets were fired into his SUV. He was not in it. Allegedly, there was a feud with another rapper. Detectives say much of what happened today is all caught on security cameras from the hotel. After Young Dolph was shot, he staggered into this nearby shoe store and the three suspects fled on foot even though they arrived, according to police, in this gold-colored SUV. Was the victim armed? No. Not that we're aware of. We haven't found a handgun. Nobody said he was armed. Video surveillance does not show that. Police say the three suspects are still on the loose. However, about two blocks away from the shooting, they did detain three men. Two of them, we are told, have been released, but this man remains in police custody and is still being questioned. Turns out the man who was taken into custody 
was one of Yo Gotti's right hand men. So you already know what time this is. Yo Gotti's got a hard on for Dolph. With this, the war in Memphis continues. What you get? Chocolate chill. Don't hide hide. Just for you. Appreciate you, baby. Be safe. This has been the Warren Memphis. Make sure you're subscribed and locked in for the next episode, cause we coming right at you. One. So much ice. I should have brought my fur. After the club, I'm on my knee with her. Go tell your German man to step it up. Cause the stones are frying up.